To prove the point, he turned to move again. I, however, unable to quell my excited curiosity, managed to slip in one more question. Mr. Grummage, sir, what's the captain's what's the captain's name? Mr. Grummage stopped again, frowning in irritated fashion, but all the same consulted his paper. Captain Jaggery, he announced, and once more turned to go. The author interested me by already adding a very pessimistic character, Mr. Grummage, opposing Charlotte's Charlotte Doyle's excitement of questioning Mr. Grummage. I definitely concur with you. Charlotte's excitement and curiosity is emphasized with the italics on the word Captain Jaggery. Here, the porter exclaimed suddenly, he had both come up close and overheard our talk. Both Mr. Grummage and I looked about. Did you say Captain Jaggery? The porter demanded. In the text, it includes italics on Captain Jaggery negatively, so we know he might be the main antagonist. Yeah, I agree, because the porter says it in a loathsome voice. Are you addressing me, Mr. Grummage inquired, making it perfectly clear that if so, the porter committed a serious breach of decorum. I was, the man said, talking over my head. And I'm asking if I heard right when you said we was going to a ship mastered by a certain Captain Jaggery. He spoke the name Jaggery as if it were something positively loathsome. Jeez, this boy really seems to hate Captain Jaggery. Yeah, I agree with you. I wonder if Captain Jaggery feels the same way. He is talking with an accent too, if we was. Sounds very British? I guess so. I was not addressing you, Mr. Grummage informed the man, but I hears you all the same, the porter went on, and so saying he swung my trout down upon the duck with such a ferocious cry that I feared it would snap in two. I don't intend to take one more step toward anything to do with Mr. Jack, not for double gold, not one more step. The porter has some serious anger issues. It sounds like it's foreshadowing some problems. Maybe it was the murder on the book talks about. Sounds like his accent is more New Jersey like. It makes me think of Al Capone. Now I'm glad he left though. It's a bit hard pacing of him around, and I definitely see the foreshadowing in the dialogue. Very sketchy. Let's keep reading.